What is up guys, Raymond here, also known as Rayvision, and check it out today while well, we are going to win some Forza Horizon 2. That though is just going to be a bit of background footage. What we're really doing today is a good old fashioned Q&A. And so I am going to dive right into it. So, um, which would you choose, okay? A Honda S2000 or a Mazda MX-5 or a Miata? Now this, my friend Ellie Moody, is a very good question. I would go with the Mazda MX-5. That is because it is the car I am the most familiar with or else I go with the Honda S2000. And the only reason why I have to choose is I'm really choosing between the S2000 and the MX-5 because off the top of my head, I can't remember what a Miata is. I know I've heard it before, and I'm sure I've seen it before, but off the top of my head, I cannot remember, so I'm not 100%. I don't know every car in the world. Sometimes I do need a bit of remembering, so that is my choice. Next question comes from Alex Nizami. Now, before I read this question, I just want to ask you guys one big favor. Um, if you do like the Q&A series, be sure to leave your questions below because I cannot keep this series going if you guys do not give me questions because, well, questions are important. And even if it's the dumbest question in the world and you think it is absolutely irrelevant, feel free to put it down below, guys. There's no such thing as a stupid question. Next. Alex asks, hey, any chance you will be doing Bruise videos in the near future? I really like those. Um, with regards to Bruise, right now, I don't know. Maybe I might do one here and there, but it's not going to be the main uh, driving force of my channel. Uh, right now, uh, I'm doing Forza. When uh, GTA 5 comes out, I'm going to be doing some stuff in that. When Halo, uh, the Master Chief, uh, Master Chief Collection comes out, I'm going to be doing some videos in that. I'm trying to get uh, World Tank to take up a bit of a position on my channel. Right now, my main games are going to be Trackmania 2, obviously. Hopefully not the original. World of Tanks, Forza Horizon 2, and maybe something else. That is what we are sticking with at the moment. Okay, so Tama Turku, I don't know how to pronounce your la uh, last name, but Tama, asks, Do you like JDM cars? If so, uh, which specific ones? So, I have a very brief general idea of what JDM cars. Um, I don't know all the different models, but if I had to choose one, because I am a bit of a rally guy, I'd have to go with the Subaru WRX STI, of course. It's me, guys. Come on. Subaru. All the way for me. Um, so that would be my choice. Finally, our last question today, uh, which is a very uh, good one, comes from AW Kuda. If four-wheel drive and all-wheel drive were still not invented, which would you pick? Four-wheel drive or real-wheel drive? Keep in mind, you live in Canada and the street and street drifting is wrong. Um... I'll tell you something, okay? Yes, I do live in Canada, and drifting in the middle of the street is not something you want to be doing, but that is why there are such things as abandoned parking lots. And so with that in mind, I would take the four-wheel drive any day. Four-wheel drive, hell no, I'm not having that. I love that real-wheel drive goodness. So, my question for you guys today is... Hmm, I haven't thought of this one. Ah, uh, here we go, here we go. I have a good one. If you could have any car, but, now here's the but, here's the but. Um, if you could have any car, but this car, anytime you got into a car, that car would automatically end. So, if you needed to transport uh, more than two people, that wouldn't work if you choose a supercar, because every time you get into a car, it's automatically that one car. Like, I know it's, this is a completely theoretical scenario, so, if, it, if you say Ferrari F12, that means uh, even if you sit down in your friend's car, all of a sudden it becomes a Ferrari F12. So every time you sit in a car, it becomes that vehicle, and so you're stuck for it with uh, for the rest of your life. Which car would you choose? That's a good one right there. So uh, I will leave you guys to answer that in the comments below. Please leave your questions um, in the comments below. And as usual, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, hope you all enjoy. And uh, I will see you all next time. Did you hear all that?